everyone, it's Sammy from Sammy Sweet Life, and today I am trying to make French onion soup in the Instant Pot. I am still trying to come up with a cutesy little name for this experiment thing that I'm doing. So I'm going to just be, you know, trying things in my Instant Pot that I would normally cook a different way. And so this is going to be one of those recipes. I'm basing mine off of a recipe. I will link to the original recipe down below. I changed it up a bit because I don't usually put white wine in my um, French onion soup, but I took like the technique from it. So right now I have my Instant Pot on saute, and I am just sauteing my onions in a little bit of butter. I didn't have three tablespoons like the recipe recommended, so I just used some of my olive oil. Uh, and I'm just sauteing these with um, with about two cloves of garlic. And so they're just in here. I'm gonna wait till they're translucent and then I will um, use the pressure cook feature. So I really love the Instant Pot because I'm using this as a one pan dish, you know? I'm using one big pot and I can do the sauteing and the pressure cooking with the same tool. So it's really nice. I tweaked the recipe quite a bit, like I said. I used way, way more onions than the recipe called for. I think it called for two big onions. I used five big onions, so mine is going to have a lot of onions. All right, my onions are looking very translucent. So the original recipe says to add three tablespoons of water and um, add a bay leaf. So I'm just gonna add the bay leaf and just a couple of splashes of my beef broth to go ahead and you know get the beef flavor and the onions, and then we're going to pressure cook this um, for 20 minutes. Okay, my bay leaf is in there. I'm gonna get that mixed in with the rest. All right. Closing it off. So I've got it on here. I've got it set to pressure, and I've got it set. I just went pressure cook, pressed up the button to 20, and made sure my pressure level was high. So it's coming to pressure right now. All right, so we'll go ahead and open it because pressure came down. We'll see. Oh, they look pretty good. They're getting some richness in the color there. Olivia's here helping me. So let's give it a stir and see. They look pretty good. Um, I'm going to try to get that bay leaf out. And now I'll just add the rest of the ingredients. I think I'll put it on the soup feature. Cookies. We're not making cookies today, baby. I think they look really good. I'm surprised how good they look. Since my onions were cooked down so well, I think I'm just going to set it on saute uh, and let it just simmer for a little while. And then I think it'll be done. It looks really good. The onions cooked down so quickly. That was so much better than having to babysit them on the stovetop. So I'm just going to put it on saute. Probably let's do 20 minutes. And I'm just in the other room playing with stickers so I can keep an eye on it. Okay, I let it simmer and I am calling it done. So here is my setup here. I'm going to stick this under the broiler so I've got some croutons in there. These are just those bakery things I get at HEB. They're called garlic munchies. So they're under there. I broke them up because they are kind of big. And then just put a piece of provolone cheese over the top. It's getting bubbly in there. And there is the soup. I left it under the broil for just a couple of minutes and I kept my eye on it because I have burned it before. So here it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give me a thumbs up if you like these Instant Pot videos and I will catch you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.